there were two runners in front of me that got hit by some shrapnel on their legs and they went to the ground. So there was definitely a, a concussive type shrapnel bomb. It was one, you think it, you, you think it might have been a bomb? I think it was a bomb, that was two of them. It, it, it was, didn't come from the street, it didn't come from a manhole, it was along the sidewalk where all those people were mingling out in front of the restaurants. And of course, that's that man speculating right now. We have nothing confirmed in terms of whether or not this was a manhole cover, or whether or not this was, in fact, a bomb. But he was just describing that it was on the this, this sidewalk. And this is one man's description of what happened. He said he did not hear, uh, he did not see, rather, any flames. Instead, he saw a white cloud of smoke. And he was pretty insistent that it was along the sidewalk. And All right, it so this is um, New England Cable News. Uh, and uh, again, uh, none of us on the air here, forensic experts. Uh, Experts, but we, um, you can see the uh, kind of cordite uh, uh, white powder after effects of an explosion uh, flush to the left hand side along the sidewalk. Uh, and uh, that's not traditionally where uh, manhole covers uh, are. They're uh, centered in the, in the street. So this, this would appear to be two blasts at or near the base of the building. And I think. This is again the immediate aftermath from WHDH. See the media tent, medical tent there in the foreground, the scissor truck, camera platform. And let's go to our coverage. This is NBC 